Hey guys, welcome back to Chicka Chicka Boom Boom. Blondie here, and today I have what you're looking at right now is a whole bunch of green art supplies, except for this colored pencil. This is not a colored pencil. Ugh, this is a mechanical pencil and this eraser for the drawing part. But when I color it in, I'm only using green art supplies, including Sharpies. I'm not even allowed to do a black or brown outline. This is too much green. Here we go. First, let me just show the art supplies that I have. First, I have a, this Crayola green colored pencil, and I also have the Crayola yellow green colored pencil. I also have a Crayola green marker, and I also have a Crayola green crayon. And then I have all of these Sharpies, like I have this dark green one, this, I guess, turquoise this blue one, but on, in real life it looks more green than it does on camera. And then here is this like light green, like it's not really light, it's like, it looks like this yellow green colored pencil. And then finally this mint green Sharpie. And then, of course, let's go on with the sketch. Alright, so I have the rough sketch down. And now I'm going to use these green art supplies to outline it. Well, I'm going to use the green Sharpies too. So I don't know if I'm going to be able to use all of them, but I'm going to try. So basically, this cat is all green because he's about to barf, as you can tell by his mouth. So why is this cat about to barf, you may ask? Um, so he, could, he just got off of a roller coaster, and he's feeling a little queasy. So he's about to barf, and he's real dizzy by his as you can tell by his eyes and everything. So he's like trying to rush to a trash can because he does not want to barf on the ground and then have to clean it up. So, yeah. And I actually just realized that I forgot to give him some arms. So I'm just going to do that. Perfecto, and now I'm going to actually swatch all my art supplies up here. Alright, so there's all these swatches of the green Sharpies, which I'm done using. And now for my Crayola marker. So I actually just got a huge pack of these fine tip Sharpies, which I really love. So that's cool. So I wanted to use a bunch of those today. So yeah, that's why I was... That's why I had a whole bunch of those picked out, because I got a huge pack of them, and it came with a lot of green ones, so gotta use them. Alright, so those are all my art supplies. Time to erase the, the sketch. Okay, so it is all erased now, and it's time to start coloring him in. Alright, so got him colored in with my help of my tippity tap tappers. So... There was a random piece of hot glue on there. And I love the way that I like decided to blend the colored pencils. And now I'm going to take this Crayola marker and color in his nose and give him some claws. And the insides of his ears are also going to be green, of course, because everything has to be green. And the final detail I'm just going to add is some green swirls to the background and making it look very dizzy like he's in it's like he fell through that hole that Alice did in Alice in Wonderland so yeah perfecto everything's coming out nicely I'm gonna make one behind his tail too to add some extra detail All right, I think it turned out really nicely. I'm just gonna add one more. Maybe I'll just add some right in here. All right. Well guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, give it a big thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. Click over here to subscribe on like on this side of the screen to subscribe and 
click right over here to see my latest video. Bye!